what is up youtube it's your girl love back in the butt and today we're back with another video um today we're doing something different we're doing a reaction video and you know who we're gonna be reacting to As you can see by the title <laughs> we're gonna be reacting to crazy man pretty boy fredo now this man is crazy this man is crazy you know um i used to watch some of his videos and um and just the way he thinks is just very crazy to me. Even, even as a young person, I'm just saying just the way this man thinks. It's very scary. It's very scary. Um, I ain't even gonna say too much. Let's just let's let's just get into this. Maybe I'm maybe what I'm looking at, he might be a little it might it might switch up. Might be a little better. You know what I mean? Who knows? Let's let's get into this. Now we're gonna be watching like a series, um, you want to know where i got the videos i got this from the voice for the voice for the people and kind of had like a series going on like it's just multiple videos about pretty boy fredo so we're probably just going to watch multiple in this one video so all week fredo has been announcing that he's going live to address the beef with ddg he even had a countdown and named it moonwalking in soho so ddg knew that he was coming for him directly so mainly this live was supposed to be about ddg and fredo but when fredo called ddg out and asked people to tag ddg to join the live so they can address their beef ddg didn't respond and he also had fredo blocked but ddg did tweet out lil bro mental and ddg brother also went live on his live and said some things about fredo the timestamps are down below so fredo went in on ddg because he didn't respond and fredo also talked about cj so cool chris sales and <laughs> you gonna go in on a man because he didn't respond ddg ain't lying he is mental and funny mike the timestamps are down below if you want to skip ahead you a family man now i respect it bro i respect it you a family man now but you a you, know, you was mad that I passed you up back in the day. I remember the sub count. He was mad. He was mad that I passed him up. I took a break off YouTube for like a year or two. I remember he passed me up. He's been going ever since. I, you know what I'm saying? Congratulations to you. I hope that you are the next black man to hit 10 million subscribers on YouTube. But I don't with you. You a fake ass, bro. I kept this shit real from the start with this, bro. I kept this shit. You know the thing about Pretty Boy Fredo is. Sometimes he has moments where he looks really manly or he acts really manly, but then he has his other moments where he acts a little sus. A little sus. Just a little. Not even a little. I'm, I'm lying. He acts sus. Get real from the start, bro. He said, who is CJ? So, oh my God, I got to pin this. Don't even know you. I'm about to revive your career, bro. I'm about to revive your career. <laughs> I'm about to revive your career. He said, who is this? My nigga, I kept it real from you from the start, bruh. I kept it real from you to start. I want y'all to see this. This is a message back in 2016. He was going through some shit. I remember he was going through some shit. Um, I think he gave his kid laxatives. Y'all remember that? Y'all remember that? Y'all remember when CJ So Cool gave his kids laxatives? Wow. All right, anyways. Um... I messaged him. I ain't never had a problem with this a day in my entire life. I ain't never said nothing disrespectful about him. But bro, bro, always sneak sneak this in on YouTube. Always sneak this in. Not on YouTube, but on Twitter. Always sneak this in, bro. Fredo this, Fredo that, Fredo this, Fredo that. That, that you, you a real. The thing is, you know, this. I know this this um this channel and if there were receipts they would definitely put the receipts up. So it's kind of like very shocking the fact that there are no receipts of like all these tweets, Fredo this, Fredo that. I'm just putting it out there. I'm just putting that out there. You are really because you could have DM me at any time. This is this is back in 2016. I'm gonna turn off the comments, bro. This is back in 2016. I have kept it real with me since day one, bro. This n had got caught up in some shit about customized insurance. You gotta see to believe. Liberty, 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 liberty. Be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes. About the laxative print, right? 
read the text. It says, what's up? Congrats on all your success. Keep grinding, bro. For all the haters, we all make mistakes. Just got to learn from them and keep pushing, bro. You got my support. If that ain't a real I don't know what to say. Instead of jumping on the bandwagon, hating on this nigga, because I could have did that, I actually just... Notice the messages. If you really had a problem, why didn't you just text them? Why are you coming on live? Makes no sense at all whatsoever. I'm just saying, like, huh. He acts so hard, like, trying to act so hard. Then it's like, certain stuff you do, it's like, you could, come on now, come on now. Just DM this, like, yo, keep your head up, bro. Keep your head up. We all make mistakes. But I ain't finna be one of these and just hate on you even more. I'm gonna keep it real with you. I'm gonna slide in a DM and I DM'd him. And I DM'd him. And I DM'd him. Okay. And every, and, 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 and who, they don't even know who the f this is. Why well, am I talking about this? Not everybody's gonna know everybody. And honestly, I'm reviving your career, bro. Hashtag who is CJ so cool? Hashtag who is CJ so cool? He's so tired. Happy Pan DJ so cool. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God. Hashtag who is CJ so cool. And ever since then, you've been sneak dissing, my, sneak dissing me, my. You've been sneak dissing me. Your views have dropped. You've been sneak dissing me, bro. And I, I really don't appreciate that shit, my. I really don't. Because like, at any moment, you can DM me, bro. I initiated the DM just showing you love. Yeah, he got kid subs. Just be like, my subs are like 13. Nah, that kid subs are like five years old. That I took my kid to the water park to play on my car, and those subs are like five years old. Not mine. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Anyways, at any moment, that could have DM me, but then always sneak this on Twitter. If you want to smoke, I'm going to text you right now. I'm going to DM you on Twitter to pull up. I just DM'd him right now. Pull up to the stream. I'm sorry I brought this upon you guys. I'm sorry. Look at that. What'd that say? Earlier this year, this was, um, he was messaging, uh, he was sneak dissing on Twitter. Earlier this year. I already sent the tweet. The shit's already sent. I already DM, DM'd him, bro. Uh, hashtag revive CJ so cool. This is, this is your revive. I hope you get 10 mil off this shit. I hope you get 10 mil off this shit, bro. How old is CJ so cool? Oh my fucking God. How old is this? Cause y'all. Say I'm old. I ain't 27. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that been hating on me since he was 30. He's only a few years older than you. Like what? He ain't never at me. Have y'all ever? He's 31. He's 31. He's 31. Yo, this dude is childish. Son, my, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. If you allow me to get to you at 31, that's gonna be our problem. CJ. If you're still acting childish at 27, that's a problem. I, I don't understand how the way this man thinks. He gave his kids laxatives. Couldn't be me? How old is this nigga, bro? Can I even Google this? Yo, this nigga born in the 80s. Oh, fuck. Yo, in the 80s? And then you got those friends in the background that's just kind of like slow, like hyping them up a bit. Your friends need to tell you to get off live. They are some real friends. They tell you to get off live because you're embarrassing yourself. Look how you just got up out the chair. You sneak dissing and you were born in the 80s? Oh my fucking God. Crack baby. Oh my God. You sneak dissing and you were born in the 80s. You need a med kit. Whoa. <laughs> Man. You need a mad kid. You need a mad kid. Whoa. Yo, I'm going to give you like five minutes to join the stream. Otherwise, I'm not talking about you ever. Look, I told y'all he was childish. This man could have bought the jug of apple juice. He just had to go with the juice box. He's childish. I mean, the juice box matches his, his attitude, if I'm being honest. Again, my y'all sit here in the stream, tell him to pull up. We can chat it. What up, guys? What's going on, bro? 
Tell him, tell him you good? Right, I'm, I'm good. I'm cool. What's up? I had to clip that part because we want to continue with uh, CJ So Cool. Like, you know, somebody who he's actually beefing with. So, yeah. If you didn't see what Fredo said about CJ So Cool, you can Ooh. skip to that part of the video. I added the whole live of him talking about CJ So Cool. So you can see that whole clip if you didn't see it in my previous video. Ooh. The links to my previous video is popping up. If you want to check that out, he did talk about Funny Mike. He talked about Chris Sales and DDG. So that video is popping up. But CJ So Cool tweeted, all of a sudden, Pretty Boy Fredo wants smoke. I guess they can't understand how I'm winning six years later, 11 cars later, and 2 billion views later. Hashtag pray for Fredo. I think he's on coke. Pretty boy Fredo, I thought. I do agree. And you know, CJ so cool, kind of like, he really handled that very maturely. Um, in a way that, you know, of course, Pretty boy Fredo wouldn't. You know, he definitely handled that very, very maturely. Um, as he should. But we were cool, but I see how it is. And for the record, I still don't have a problem with anybody. I'm only here for my family and my supporters and everything else is irrelevant. Then CJ So Cool posted up the DM of him responding back to Fredo's pull up to the stream. Hey yo, thanks for all that tough talk. I'm super late to the beef. Didn't even know it was smoke, but I'm with it. Next time you feel like you saying my name, I never use Twitter at all. So call me next time for a faster response. And I'm pretty exactly. sure he gave him his number. We're exactly. He doesn't use Twitter. That's what I'm saying. Where where is the receipts? Where is the receipts? It just doesn't make sense. It's not adding up was not done fredo kept going he said you were born in the 80s let's compare our channels you're definitely still winning with two million more subs than me cj so cool you your kids with laxative you don't even deserve to have kids you should be in j you jumped a child for view now don't get me wrong that right there is a, that's a reach you know what i'm saying definitely should not give your kid laxatives i mean unless they're like super constipated i mean we really don't know the circumstances but i'm just saying you should be in jail. What kind of father is this? You're praising money instead of taking care of your responsibility. YouTubers like CJ So Cool is the reason why I barely put my daughter on YouTube. I'll never take my child and export my baby for a check. Yikes. It look like this is going way left. I didn't even Agreed. know I had beef with CJ. I thought they were cool. I don't even know where this is coming from. And I was right. CJ So Cool. I mean, he kind of stay out the mix. I mean, behind that whole teen scandal or whatever, but. You're not really, you know, in the drama like that. So this is very shocking to me. DJ So Cool don't even know where this is coming from. He's actually bringing something that happened in 2016 that CJ So Cool was trying to get past. I know Royalty said something. She said, these dudes emotional like itches. Y'all leave y'all comments down below because it looked like this beef ain't ending no time soon. It looks like it's going on and on. Even DDG responded in the inbox last night and it's still going on right now. So I posted up that DM. Make sure you stop, read, and pause. And also CJ So Cool is retweeting a lot of tweets as well. So make sure you stop, pause, and read those tweets as well. Leave comments down this is Peacock. Peacock, baby. It's streaming and it's free. Free. Cringy, cringy, guilty, reality. Free, free, free. Down below, let me know what you're thinking. Until next time, peace. You know, I feel like that concludes, you know, the end of this video. This man is a lunatic. You know, you'll probably see me doing more reactions on him because, he, you know, I'm, what I'm hearing, this man went crazy on a lot of people. I mean, a lot of people. So, you know, expect a new reaction on him coming soon. Of course, I'll be doing more reactions since this is new. Um, this man is crazy. I just pray for anybody that's dealing with him because, woo. The way he thinks, it's a lot of immaturity. It's a lot of immaturity. You know, also drop down in the comments, you know, what, what other videos you want me to react to. This is going to be like a new thing for me. I hope you guys enjoy.